Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I have my June favourites for you all. Obviously now we're into July which is really exciting because it means hopefully, hopefully because we're in England, it's going to get warmer because I'm fed up of all the rain in this country. First of all I'm going to start from my makeup things. I do actually have quite a few because I have bought a few new products this month and I've really enjoyed using them. First thing I've really been loving this month is this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. This is actually in the shade 15. I've actually seen on YouTube they have shade 10, 15 and 20 and 15 is actually the lightest shade that is such a weird way of doing it because you think 10 was because it's the least number this is quite creamy so if you have dry under eyes this would be such a good thing for you and as I said I did get the lightest shade because I like to highlight underneath my eyes and this is actually amazing for the price the next thing I have is this Kika eyeshadow if you've actually watched my channel before you would have seen me use this in my prom tutorial this is like a salmony pink colour I've had this for quite a while and I've never really picked it up before I never thought I'd really like it that much but I just bought it to try it and I actually love this after using it it's so so pigmented and so buttery and creamy and when this hits the light it looks so shimmery and makes your eyes pop it's also really inexpensive so if you're looking for a new brand to find eyeshadows from I would definitely recommend Kiko to check their products out because they are so inexpensive the next thing I've been loving, um, I've actually bought this this month. This is the Maybelline Brow Drama in Dark Brown. This is a sculpting brow mascara and I know I'm a bit late to this one but I didn't really think of doing much or do anything different to what I already do to my brows. This is the wand in case you haven't already seen it and you just run this through your brows and it just makes them more defined, more sculpted and also adds like little fibres onto your brows to make them look more thick and more full. I wasn't sure whether to get this or not, but I'm so glad I did because I use this over my brows to set them. That makes sure they stay in place all day and make sure they do not budge. And I also use this on days where I don't really want to wear that much makeup because it just makes sure my brows have a little something in and makes them look more full. The next two things I've been loving are in the same category, so I thought I'd do them together. These are the Primark Sultry Lashes and these are only a pound. These are so good. I picked these up thinking that there'd be nothing, thinking they'd be rubbish, but I thought for a pound I might as well give them a go. I've actually worn these about five times, obviously I've washed them in between, but I've worn them about five times and they're still going strong and even some expensive lashes that I own don't even do that. So these are so, so good for the price. And then along with that, I've been living this duo eyelash adhesive, which is the eyelash glue. Um, this is the dark tone one, which is why I like it so much, because I do have the clear one. However, it can look, because my hair is so dark, you can see it. This one dries um, a dark colour, a dark tone as well. So this looks incredible on my eyes because you can't see the lash pan whatsoever. So if you have dark hair and are struggling to apply lashes, maybe try this glue because this is amazing. Next thing that I've really been enjoying using is this Barry M Speedy Quick Dry Nail Paint. And this one dries really fast. Um, I actually bought this on Oxford Street when I went to London um, just because I don't really have a nail varnish that I love in case any of you are wondering it's not actually what's on my nails today I actually got my nails done in the salon and this is actually an OPI shade I'm not sure what it is however as I was saying this doesn't actually have a shade number it's just the pink version um, these dry so quickly because if you're impatient like me and you hate waiting for your nails to dry and always end up smudging them this is so good because it dries so fast um, and also it doesn't chip on me. My next favourite is this Ariana Grande perfume. Now I don't know if you can see but this is literally all gone there. It's literally just a drop left. This bottle is so unique and I love the shape of it. And it comes with a little pom pom which is so cute. Um, this smells incredible. Next I thought I'd do a TV favourite or like a series favourite. So I've been watching the Vampire Diaries on Netflix and it is so so good. I started watching it before my exams and then as I did my exams I kind of left it um, so that it didn't get into my head and confuse any revision that I had done and now I started it again yesterday and I'm so addicted it's so good so it's kind of like a mysterious kind of series it's kind of reminds me of Pretty Little Liars which is also one of my favorites but if you are looking for a new series Definitely check the Vampire Diaries out. The film favourite this month, me and my mum actually went to watch Me Before You, I think it's called. The film's called Me Before You. It was actually a book, 
But that film is so incredible and it's filmed so well. It's so sad you will need to take a packet of tissues because it did make me cry. And I don't normally cry at films, but it's so sad but such a good film. So it's a story where a girl loses a job in a cafe and she finds a new job of caring for a man who's actually been in an accident. It's a love story and it's such a cute story. However, it is so sad. It's all my favourites from June. If you like these type of videos, let me know down below and I can do more of them. I just thought I'd do a bit more of a chatty video, a bit of something different. So if you like this video, be sure to give a big thumbs up and be sure to subscribe down below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.